What's up? Like, what's going on with you and Michael? After you had left, him and I had a like a heart to heart about everything that's been going on, and he's staying in a hotel, and I'm like doing all this driving, doing all this driving to see the kids. So, like, I just asked him to stay at the house with the kids while he's up here. <clears throat> Say that again. He's not. I just asked him to stay at the house with me and the kids. How's that working out? But we, we're not moving in together. All right, say that one more time, because now I'm confused. But I, instead of staying in a hotel, he's only going to be here for a little bit longer. I asked him to stay at the house with me and the girls. OK, y'all sleep in the same room? We do not sleep in the same room. I want to know the dynamic of what y'all got going on. Uh. It's, I got, like, we got so it. I got to ask these questions. No, you have every right to ask these questions. It's you, very awkward. Did he try to get with you recently or anything like that? Like Michael and I haven't done anything, if that's what you're asking. Like, I haven't cheated on you or nothing, if that's what you're asking. I get when I'm in a relationship, it's wrong to have another male under my roof. I understand that, especially it's an ex. It's very uncomfortable. It's not just an ex, though. Like, we have two kids with this guy. Where would we go after this? What, go to a hotel?